Today we're gonna paint something super cute and super fun. Grab your watercolors and give them a spritz. You can do this with any colors you want. I'm gonna be doing the body of mine in pinks and purples. And I wanna start with a nice dark purple color. I'm gonna load my brush up with that and make two circles, spacing them about two circles distance apart. Wash my brush and grab a nice bright pink color. And on the top, I'm gonna make kind of a little smiley face shape, bring that down, and then I'm gonna go around those circles, they're the eyes, and try not to touch them. Paint in the area in between, add a little water to my brush, and then I'm going to bring it out and down, We're making kind of a blob shape at the bottom. I'm gonna fill that all in, and then I'm gonna come back in with some brighter pink and drop it in in just a couple different spots. And I'm also going to bring in some purples and some blues to shade around the bottom. On the bottom, where it flares out a Bit, we're gonna take our brush, touch and press a little ways away, and then flick in until it just touches where the body is. Then we need to let this dry or make it dry. Once it's dry, I wanna take an even darker purple or bluish color, and I'm gonna make two circles within the circles that are a little bit smaller. In between the circles and slightly down, I'm gonna make a little smile type shape. Again, we're gonna let this dry or make it dry. Then I'm gonna mix up a nice blue color and I'm also gonna have a little green on hand because I'm gonna go around the entire shape of this and occasionally dip into a little bit of this green just to get a little variation. Once I have the background in, again, I'm gonna let it dry or make it dry. At this point, if you think you've blown it, you haven't because I'm gonna use a white gel pen to add in these details that are gonna really make it pop. I'm gonna outline around the eyes, give them a little highlight. Oh my gosh, the highlight makes it so cute. Around the entire shape, emphasize the little fins, outline the mouth, and then also further define the smile. And then I'm gonna add in a whole bunch of little spikes. This one is so cute and it's really fun to do. 